So I finally caved in and got myself a pop socket, just in black, with yeah, it looks a little bit like an LP. <laughs> And it's quite flat, so I hope it's not going to take up too much space. Let's see how it looks. Good morning, everybody. I've already done my whole base, including my lipstick, because I already knew that I was going to wear Charlotte Tilbury, American Sweetheart. And I just wanted to go for neutral brown eyes, so I'm going to take the Natasha Denona Gold Palette. And I'm going for this color here, which is Aria. Just a nice fluffy blending brush. Let me get a little mirror. Gonna take a smaller brush as well, like a little pencil brush. Tap in the color again and go underneath the eye with it as well. Maybe along the lash line, a little extra oomph, <laughs> intensify the color just a little bit. You can pack it on more than with a fluffy blending brush, you can diffuse the color. So that's smoky eye done. Or Minus mascara, maybe liner, I'm not sure. I've decided to do a liner, but not your traditional liner. I'm going to take another color from this palette and I'm going to go for the dark brown. This one here, the color is called Log, L-O-G. And I'm going to take like an um, angle brush, dip it in there, tap off the excess so it doesn't fall down and just Along the lash line, tiny eyeliner to define the, the lash line a little bit. Not too extreme, but I love angled brushes to apply eyeliner. Just goes so quick. L'Oreal Voluminous Waterproof. There you go. Because I need waterproof mascara. It's just my my preference. Doing the lower lash line last, so the upper one can dry. This mascara dries pretty quickly. Wait a little bit for the lower part. There you have a closer look of my makeup: brown smoky eye, pink lip. Have a great day, everybody. I am preparing a veggie wrap with grilled zucchini, um, lente eitjes, or bos eitjes, spring onions, <laughs> some carrots, so to have a little crunch, and baby spinach. Yummy! Hi guys, I just wanted to show you the new L'Oreal Impalable Fresh Wear 24 hour wear foundation available in 28 colors. At the end for the upcoming three weeks at this cool foundation tower. Hello, guys, I'm back home now and I have my color i picked up a second color actually 135 i also have 130 and if i mix these up i will get my shade um yeah i'm excited to try these out i also wanted to show you when you're at the shop at the end there is the a little guide showing you which color you could be depending on your kind of undertone of the skin if it's cool neutral or warm and they also show you when you swatch it in the shop what is the best way to swatch it like on the um on your jaw going down to your neck because swatching swatching it on your hand from my experience is not the best way you can you can get the undertone of the foundation but the hands are mostly much lighter than the face because you wash them more often and the skin exfoliates more than skin in your face just a little tip 
And now for the fun part, Loria asked me to do a challenge to test this foundation if it is really sweat proof, long wearing, if it has a natural finish, all the things it says it does. So tomorrow I'm going to wear this foundation and um, you guys can decide challenge number one, yoga or challenge number two, an intense workout. So choose here. And let's have fun tomorrow.